Hi, it's Lauren Seiden from the Development. And I put a question out on the blog the other day, and that was, what do you believe is something that is holding you back from really living your dreams, from reaching everything that you want in your life? And the response has been interesting. And mostly what's coming up is it's scheduling. It's feeling like too many priorities, too much to do, and not sure where to focus your time, and not having real strategies in place so that you know and plan ahead what to do and what's really important and what really is uh, helping you get towards the result that you want to achieve. So I want to share with you guys something that I use in my life a lot. It's been a really helpful tool, strategy, um, that when I implement and when I really look at where am I spending my time, that's what's really stopping a lot of you. It's not knowing where you focus and where you're spending your time. So I'm going to share with you Stephen Covey's four quadrants right now. And the first category of that quadrant is focusing on what's important and what's urgent. And this category is having a business meeting coming up, having a deadline for something, um, your kid gets sick and all of a sudden is home from school, now it's important and urgent, something that's really in your face or something that's a short-term deadline. So right under this category, I'm going to write, these are deadlines, right? These are super important, but they are urgent as well. But then there's this category over here called important, but not urgent. So a lot of times, these get kind of brushed to the side, and these are things that we really want in life. Actually, this category is where we have the most growth. So this is the most important category to actually focus on. So I'm going to put growth here. And this category can be your health. This can be spending time with your kids, really focusing on your intimate relationship, fo focusing on building a business versus that one meeting that's coming up. So maybe you're in a job, but you had something else going on on the side or something you really want to focus on, but you keep getting stuck with all the urgencies and not really getting to the bigger picture of what you want to start planning. So these are things that sometimes have to be planned ahead. Maybe it's taking a vacation with your friends, having some downtime at the end of the day. Then there's a category that's called not important, but urgent, right? So this is our phone buzzing. It rings all the time. Your text message is coming through. Now you've got your Facebook message, your LinkedIn, your Twitter. This is everything coming in to you, right? So these are the things that are distractions. This may be your coworker running in and just saying, I need you to do this. Your kid's running and grabbing you. you got to drive me somewhere, right? These are the things that we don't know. They are important to someone else, right? In the other person's category, this may be important and urgent, important and not urgent. But to all we know is to us right now is that it's an urgency that's not getting us to where we want to go. So what happens is when we plan, we know these are going to come up. That's part of life. But when we plan ahead and we really make sure a lot of time is planned for this category, we find that then there's some space that we leave open for that stuff to come up versus letting this stuff and this stuff run your day. So over here, I'm going to call these distractions or disruptions, right? Let's call them disruptions. All right. And then over here, we're going to have a category that's called not important and it's not urgent. So these are things, this is just time wasters. This is you're playing on Facebook, you're surfing the web too long, you're hanging out on the phone past when it's really productive, you're staying up till 2 a.m. and you're doing something. You know, sometimes it's great to kick back and be like, I'm going to give myself a half hour after my day to watch a TV show, a guilty pleasure, just check out. I'm going to read a magazine, I'm going to do something that's, that's actually productive because that's helping you relax, wind down. But when it goes into three hours, it moves from this category to the time waster category. So what we want to do is really take a look at one, where up till now are you spending your time and have you been spending your time? And then where do you need to be spending your time moving forward in order to get what you really want? So what I'd love to do is to write down what are some of the things I'm going after? What's something I know that I really want in my life? And then how do I need to prioritize my life? So organizing and prioritizing and really strategizing is what helps us get the life that we want and to live our dreams. So I hope this helps. Love to hear your feedback. Check out the tweetable below and you can sign up for updates and we'll email you guys every time we have a new video come out. And thanks for listening.